in the holler here at the NHRA Nevada Nationals, escaping the wind that's out here this morning on Sunday with Chris Demke. Chris, you were 16 on the qualifying sheet. You took out number one in Angel Sam Pei, and that shouldn't be no shock for a former world champion, but what's it like to be back in the limelight? Well, you know, I, I, I knew I, it, it, it's good to be back in the limelight. It was fun. I knew we, we were just happy to be qualified. This is a tough field, a lot of fast cars, and this race is notorious for that. You get all the good fast cars from back east coming west for the finals in Pomona and make that stop here in Vegas, which it's a great town, great track. I love this facility. And, uh, but yeah, it, 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 qualifying was challenging. This is a great tra racing surface, but you don't have the, the air to make the horsepower to, to be able to take advantage of that surface. So it's a very challenging tune-up and uh, boy being number 16 I was just glad to be in but yeah well, racing the the Samsel car with it which Angel is driving I know that's a very fast car and uh, we were I, I, I knew if we could get our tune-up good and I could cut a good light that's what it was gonna take to be able to win that round so uh, I did my job Kevin Watson our crew chief got a little more out of the car and it all worked to, to turn on the wind light you turn on the wind light and I would think as an individual that's been in this class for as long as you have been, to see this year in particular with Tony Stewart racing, Angel Sampay coming in, you got a young Norwegian winning the championship this year, that the class has turned on a wind light as a whole. Sure. Oh, in fact, I, I, I had never met Angel in person, but in the staging lanes, I went over and chatted with her and introduced myself and, you know, welcomed her the, to the category because, uh, you know, with Tony Stewart coming in and then Angel, and, uh, you know, it's, it's bringing some attention to the category, which it really needs. It was good to, it's good to have some people like that uh, with some, some uh, expo bringing some exposure to the class. Absolutely. Top alcohol dragster was able to run through completion. That will make more sense in just a moment. Your winners out of round one going into round two, they are and include Joey Severance, Madison Payne, Casey Greasel, Jackie Frick, Kim Parker, Sean Cowie, and 2023 world champion Julie Natus. As you can see here at the Nevada Nationals at the Strip at Las Vegas Motor Speedway, it is Sunday morning and Top Fuel is underway for eliminations. In Top Alcohol Funny Car, Annie Whiteley took her by run for being number one qualifier. And then we had one other pair go down the track, including Bob McCosh, which we will speak with in just a moment. And that is the most excitement we got from Top Alcohol Funny Car. That class was postponed later to today to finish out out there round one due to weather conditions. The wind picked up severely last night here at the strip and the dust came along with it. Dust on a drag strip does not create a good situation for any amount of traction and definitely for a slick top alcohol funny car. Let's hear from Bob on his wind line. In Top Alcohol Funny Car, well, the biggest excitement was a flash from this man, Bob McCosh. And Bob, you just showed me some of the damage on the motor play. It got a little warm in there. Give us the rundown of your wind light where you sacrificed one. Well, she was motoring down through there in about a thousand foot. I felt it lay over and I thought, you know, I don't see Ray. I definitely don't want to lose. So I, I legged it on down through there and right at the lights, it pushed the head gasket out on number eight cylinder and torched the head and torched the block. It was a cylinder head we'd repaired before and it pushed the repair outs what it looked like to us. The motor, by all appearances, was happy. It just got unhappy when it pushed that out and then torched the motor plate and got my fire boots, my legs, my fire pants, my gloves and it, uh, it was exciting for just a second. And then all went out, so all good. I'm Lee Kraft with this top alcohol report here at the NHRA Nevada Nationals at the Strip at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. It's brought to you by McKinney Corp. We're hoping that all rounds of eliminations get in today on race day Sunday.